Sally knew that hydrogen sulfide is a colorless gas as toxic as hydrogen cyanide. Smell does not always indicate gas presence or concentration. She read the Division H2S manual and avoided areas with posted warnings when possible. At well sites in known H2S areas, she stayed upwind from emissions and followed the operator's H2S program. She wore a division indicator badge and brought along her H2S kit containing a small mask and a few minutes of air. She let qualified well site personnel check for H2S concentrations when her detection equipment was inadequate. She didn't look into tanks or other oil field containers, especially those with lids. She knew that H2S danger can be high when steam is bled off from oil wells. Because H2S is heavier than air, she was cautious in low areas throughout the field, avoiding them when possible. Low areas at well sites are especially dangerous, but Sally forgot. She bent too close to a well cellar and was overcome by H2S fumes.